1999, MGM released the stylish, contemporary and quietly dramatic James Bond film The World Is Not Enough. This movie featured actors who have proven to be deserving to play the Bond series' iconic characters. So without further ado, let's go ahead and see how the cast of The World Is Not Enough is doing now. Let's start with legendary Irishman Pierce Brosnan, who played James Bond. Brosnan's Rotten Tomato page shows that since 1999 he has taken numerous roles in movies like The Matador, The Ghost Writer, and Love Is All You Need. Furthermore, Brosnan recently teamed up with Tourism Ireland to promote Ireland's beauty. According to IrishCentral.com, Brosnan spoke about his love for Ireland in a short video that includes shots of Ireland's most iconic landmarks. Let's move on to Sophie Marceau, who played Electric King. An article from Ranker.com showed that Sophie has worked in several French-produced films since 1999, including Anthony Zimmer, Don't Look Back, and Cartagena. Sophie currently keeps herself busy on the set of her new movie, Une Femme de Notre Dame. According to CineEuropa.org, her latest film started shooting last February, where she'll star alongside John Heldenberg as the lead cast. Let's wrap this video up with Robert Carlyle, who played Renard Zocas. Robert's IMDb page shows that after this film's release, the character is played in shows and movies such as Once Upon a Time, Stargate Universe and The Tournament. And lastly, Robert is currently filming the second season of Cobra, a show where he plays the British Prime Minister's role. According to aboutmanchester.co.uk, filming is already underway in Greater Manchester on the second series of this high-stakes political drama show. So what do you think about the cast of The World Is Not Enough? Comment it down below along with an episode suggestions that we might make in future. Also, make sure to check out our other channels, Talisman Anime and Talisman Gaming, and be sure to like and subscribe. I'll see you there.